me show you guys this miraculous new technology to fix these spots. It looks like it's thinning out and dying. It looks dry, real thin. See how it's really thin? Thin blade. No, God, please, no, 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 no! Compared to thicker blades, don't worry, the Kentucky bluegrass seed in there. See the difference? These dark green, thick blades compared to thin, Poopy blades. See how, see how much thicker those are? Let me grab another hip. So show you. Let's see the difference. See how it's curling up? Getting all thin. Let me show you this miraculous. It's kind of hard to see. But you can see it in this spot here. And it's because of the way my uh, lot slopes. Get a lot of water right here that just runs off. So let me show you this miraculous new technology that'll take care of that in a matter of no time. Let me show you. Boom, water. Just a light spot watering for a couple minutes a day. And this will be back up to this, how the rest of it's nice and thick in no time. A few days, I bet. Let's keep track, shall we? Do another video tomorrow. Check the progression. Day two of the Miracle Cure. H2O. That's what I call high quality H2O. Found another dry spot happening here. Over here on the edge. I gotta turn the sprinklers on. It's time. As you can see, just from last night, just thicken those blades up quite a bit. It's not such a crazy thin spot now. But it's starting to move over that way. You can see the color difference right where the, where the water's hitting. It's moving that way. All these damn Kentucky bluegrass seed pods everywhere. Makes the lawn look terrible. This way, you can see some, some stripies. <clears throat> All right, so this is day two. Day two of the old H2O spot watering <clears throat> experiment. It's crazy how green this is and haven't watered much. Only after fertilizer applications have I watered and we've only had two or three days of rain this entire spring all right see you on day three tomorrow can't believe I almost forgot day three just in time to show you guys this beautiful sunset
All right, so we are doing the magical H2O. H2O, H2O. The magical lawn fixer upper. It's already coming back nice. Almost fixed. Man, look at that sunset. That is beaut. That is a beaut. So as you can see, no more really thin grass blades. It's pretty much came back as a full Full thickness blades, they're no longer curled up. It's this garbage. The neighbor's garbage all over the damn place. We even had that little dry spot here. And up there, there was, I found another one up here. God, look at that. Look at that sunset. It's too bad I'm colorblind, because I'm sure it's awesome. I can tell it's pretty cool. So yeah, just three short days. On the third day of hand watering those deprived spots, they completely came back fully. Two, two to three minutes watering, just hand watering these spots. It's amazing what a little attention to detail and a little bit of love you show your property will do, or show your lawn will do. And it'll, it'll respond to a little bit of extra care. We are getting into the temperatures though, where I'm gonna have to start doing a routine watering probably twice, twice a week, half inch each time. And I got a video on that, on how to measure your water output so you can get up to it, uh, get your inch per week of water put down. How you split that up is up to you to decide what works best. But I usually do two to three cycles a week, inch total. In the hotter months, July, August, and part of September, I'll do three times a week at a half inch each time to get an inch and a half because it gets really dry and really hot in my area. So, but yeah, I mean, God, just on the third day, so two days of just hand watering, and it solved that dry spot issue. Back to the sunset. <laughs> 